Eight years ago, I was a young man, full of idealism and vigor. And look at me now. I am gray, grizzled, just counting down the days till my death panel. <laughs> Hillary once questioned whether I'd be ready for a 3 a.m. phone call. Now nah, I'm awake anyway because I got to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'm up. Even some foreign leaders, they've been looking ahead, anticipating my departure. Last week, Prince George showed up to our meeting in his bathrobe. <laughs> that was a slap in the face. <laughs> a clear breach of protocol. Is this dinner too tacky for the Donald? <laughs> what could he possibly be doing instead? Is he at home eating a Trump steak? <laughs> Tweeting out insults to Angela Merkel? What's he doing? The Republican establishment is incredulous that he's their most likely nominee. Incredulous, shocking. They say Donald lacks the foreign policy experience to be president. But in fairness, he has spent years meeting with leaders from around the world. Miss Sweden, <laughs> Miss Argentina, <laughs> Miss Azerbaijan. I just have two more words to say. Obama out. <laughs>